Hi, and welcome back to Deep Papa's Living and Flip Flop Life. Today's episode has to do with Facebook ads and uh, you getting a warning from Facebook ads or getting your ad disapproved. Are you one of those people that basically uh, you just created a Facebook ad, you put your poster, you created your poster, you click go, ready to send it out, and then Facebook says, nope, I'm not allowing you to do this. And you're like, why? And they're like, because you exceeded the 20% text on your poster. And you're like, well, how is that possible? How am I, how am I supposed to know what the 20% is? And nobody really explains this properly. Okay, and then you get, you know, you are like, all right, well, what am I supposed to put down? Then you go for stock photos, so you, and, then, and then you go around not using the one that you really wanted to use. You wanted to pass your own message, but you can't because you're scared to put um, the poster out because Facebook's going to uh, disapprove you. So basically what happens here is that when you do get a message and a, a, a warning and it tells you about the 20%, it's because it's telling you that, you know what? you need to keep it in the 20%. And how do you go about doing that? Very simply, you search on Google, put down Facebook Grid if you want, or you can download it from, uh, from my, um, my, uh, the link below. Uh, it, it's going to be through my website. It's free. Um, and what you're going to do is you're going to download this Facebook Grid. This is the grid, Okay. So what you're going to do, basically, let me explain what this grid does, and let me explain what the 20% means um, on Facebook. Um, Facebook is asking you to write, to, you're allowed to put some text in uh, up to five boxes, which is 20%. Okay, 20% is basically five boxes in this grid that you see right here. So you can have like one, two, three, four, five boxes, put your text here, and you'll be cool. Facebook will not remove it. It will not disapprove it. You can put it inside these five. Uh, horizontal, vertical, diagonal, whatever you want, but it's got to be within the five boxes. All right, just so you can be sure and make it easier for you, I'm going to show you a trick on how to use your PowerPoint presentation, how to use the grid, okay? I'm gonna copy this grid. I'm gonna paste it into my PowerPoint presentation. I'm gonna drag it so I cover the whole slide, all right? Then I'm gonna go into shapes. I'm gonna grab um, the rectangle shape, and then I'm gonna choose 20%. I'm gonna, you know, have a different color. I'm gonna remove the grid, and now what I have is a ready to go poster that I can use on Facebook. So if I open up like, for example, Diptych, Diptych is a free app, okay? Nothing I'm showing you here is promoting something. It's free and of value. So if I take the screenshot that I just took, this is showing me that the 20% is within this bar right here. So I can write my text. Let's see. Uh, image. Grab this grid um, box from my website, for example. All right. Now, that's a lot of writing, and that's 20%, guys, 20 uh, guys and girls. This is 20%. It's that simple. You know, I add your picture here of a poster there. Uh, when you're done, like, uh, I don't know. Like, I got the text now. I got the error, uh, so I can delete this um, and put something else. Like, for example, this, all right? And then you can create, you know, picture, whatever. Put your writing there. That's cool. You're covering five boxes. It's that simple, okay? And then you add that into your Facebook ads and you're good to go, all right? So I hope I gave value today. And uh, like I said, you can grab the grid box from the link below um, and any other, you know, subscribe to my channel as well so you can contact, contact me, connect with me so I can help you out with some more maybe information that you need. Okay, this is Demetrius and signing out. Peace out.